Right. So in this video, we're going to be using the angle pairs to solve for x or to find the value of x. Right. So the first thing that I, I want to identify is what type of angle pairs I have. So in this one, I know that they are adjacent angles, right, because they are next to each other. But we know that this right here is a right angle. So that means that they are also complementary angles. So that means that 6x plus 5 plus 3x plus 4 equals 90 because they are complementary angles. So 6 plus 3x is 9x, 5 plus 4 is 9 equals 90, and I'm just going to subtract 9 on both sides. So 9x equals 81, and now I'm just going to divide. So x equals 9 degrees. So the next one, these type of angles, they are vertical angles, right? And vertical angles are congruent angles. So that means that for x equals 88, and I'm just going to divide by 4, so x equals 22 degrees. The next one, again, as you can see, those two angles are, again, they are complementary angles. So x plus 50, x plus 6 plus 56 equals 90. So x equals 62, oh, x equals, no, x plus 62 equals 90. So minus 62, that means that x equals 28 degrees. So the next one, these two angles, let's forget about, let me see if I can, I think that I, let's forget about the slide right here for a second, right? So as you can see, we have angle, we have two linear pairs. We have two linear pairs because they are adjacent angles that the side that they do not share are opposite rays. So that means that they form a line. So linear pairs, linear pairs are always supplementary angles. So that means that 2x plus 46 equals 180. I'm going to subtract 46 on both sides. So 2x equals 134. And I'm just going to divide by 2. So x equals 67, 67 degrees. And that's it for this lesson. May the force be with you.